to another episode of The Space, a mindfulness podcast for everyone. I'm Casey Donovan with the words of Amy Malloy. Today we're going deep with a big conversation. Now I'm going to put a trigger warning here. We're going to be talking about death. So if you don't want to listen to this episode, you can jump to the next. How do you cope with a fear of death? Yep, you heard us. We're going there. In typical space style, the answer is unexpected. Become a DJ of your own life. This tip comes from Dr. Amid Sud, Executive Director of the Global Centre of Resiliency and Wellbeing. He studied how building resilience can help us not only feel better, but also live longer. A fear of death is natural, he says. In mild cases, we can even see it as a positive. I love life so much, I don't want to leave it. The problem is, we get caught up in negative thinking If we want our body to prepare for longevity, we need to give it momentum. We need to give it motivation. According to Dr. Sud, it's about sending a message to our bodies. I am having a good time on this planet. When you do this, your genes and immune system start planning for the long term. I better reduce inflammation. I better strengthen my immunity. The key is to find meaning in life, says Dr. Sud. You want to get busy having a party on the planet, he says. Not only being at the party, but being the DJ. If you're at the party... You might stay until midnight. If you're the DJ, you're there till 3am. Be the DJ for the party. Bring happiness to others. The best way to find happiness is to be the source of it. Find meaning in creating joy in the world, he says. When you get busy doing that, the fear of death goes away. Whether you believe positivity can increase longevity, it's a fun experiment to try. When you wake up, say to yourself every morning, I am having a great time on this planet. I am the DJ of my life. I'm Casey Donovan and you've been listening to The Space a mindfulness podcast written by Amy Malloy. We're back tonight with another mood-soothing episode. Space out.